Welcome to our channel, the portal to a world where every frame tells a story, and every review opens a door to cinematic wonders. Get ready to immerse yourself in the captivating universe of films, where a passionate team of cinephiles will guide you through a myriad of emotions, from laughter to tears, as we uncover the magic that makes movies unforgettable. It's time to dive into every major movie joining the greater Marvel Universe in 2024. At one point, Marvel's 2024 was going to shatter the record for theatrical releases within a single calendar year, with a shocking six different titles debuting from both the Marvel Cinematic Universe and Sony's Spider-Man Universe. This was before over half a dozen films from both universes faced major delays due to this summer's actors and writers' strikes, pushing these releases into 2025 and later. Specifically, Marvel Studios' Captain America, Brave New World and Thunderbolts had to push their release dates while Sony Pictures was forced to put Spider-Man, beyond the Spider-Verse release date in question, but all hope is not lost for 2024, Marvel movies hitting theaters in 2024, Madam Web, February 14, 2024. Sony Pictures will deliver a trio of Spider-Man spin-offs in 2024, starting off by putting Dakota Johnson, Sidney Sweeney, Isabella Merced, and Celeste O'Connor into the spotlight. For Madam Webb, Johnson stars as the titular Cassandra Webb, a New York paramedic who gains the ability to see the future after almost drowning before teaming up with Sweeney's Julia Carpenter, Merced's Anya Corazon, and O'Connor's Maddie Franklin. Like all of Sony's other Spider-Man-based films, Madam Web is not officially canon with the MCU, but Johnson's heroine could open the door to that crossover due to her experience with the multiverse in Marvel Comics but with multiple Spider-Women. Taking the live-action spotlight for the first time and a number of major stars adding their talents to this universe, Sony is hoping that this movie will put the studio back on track after multiple theatrical flops, Madam Web swings into theaters on February 14, 2024, Deadpool 3, July 26, 2024, at long last. Ryan Reynolds will take his Wade Wilson from the Fox Universe into the MCU in 2024 via Deadpool 3, giving Marvel Studios its first ever R-rated solo movie taking full advantage of the multiverse in the plot. Deadpool 3 is also confirmed to bring back Hugh Jackman as Wolverine as Marvel Studios embraces the X-Men. Following delays to the rest of the MCU slate, Marvel Studios made Deadpool 3 the only film in the franchise premiering in 2024, putting pressure on the studio's first R-rated film to succeed in regaining public favor. But with over half a dozen heroes confirmed for inclusion and even rumors hinting that megastar singer Taylor Swift could join the cast. Anticipation is expectedly high for what Marvel will do with Wade Wilson and company, Deadpool 3 is confirmed to debut in theaters on July 26, 2024, Craven the Hunter, August 30, 2024, Aaron Taylor Johnson will be back in the Marvel Universe after playing Pietro Maximoff slash Quicksilver in 2015's Avengers, Age of Ultron, this time embodying Sergei Kravinov in Sony Pictures' Craven the Hunter, joining Oscar winner and wish-leading Lady Ariana DeBose, Marvel and DC veteran Russell Crowe, and a few other. Major. Stars, Taylor Johnson will portray a new take on Craven that hasn't been seen before, as shown in the movie's first trailer, Craven will still show off his brutal nature as a hunter, although he'll also be humanized to a degree as fans see his origin story alongside the rest of his family, combine that with the crazy superpowers he'll gain after a tangle with a wild beast. And it's clear that Sony looks to make a statement with this take on the character courtesy of some unexpected changes. From his comic counterpart, Craven the Hunter will begin playing in theaters worldwide on August 30, 2024, Venom 3, November 8, 2024, following two successful solo movies that kicked off Sony's Spider-Man universe, along with a quick detour into the MCU, Tom Hardy will be back in action as Eddie Brock slash Venom in Sony Pictures' Venom 3. Filming initially kicked off for this sequel in June 2023 before the writers and actors strike started, and on November 24, Hardy confirmed via Instagram that the film had reconvened to finish production. At the moment, there are no signs pointing to what kind of story will be told in Venom 3, although Ted Lasso's Juno Temple and Doctor Strange's Chiwetel Ejiofor are now officially part of the cast as new characters. But after Eddie Brock and Venom had their quick detour to the MCU in Spider-Man, no Way Home's post-credit scene, 
Many will be curious to see how entangled these universes now are, Venom 3 will arrive in theaters on November 8, 2024. Spider-Man, Beyond the Spider-Verse, the biggest question mark on this list comes in the form of Spider-Man, Beyond the Spider-Verse, which was initially set for a March 29, 2024 release date before it was completely removed from Sony Pictures' release schedule. Its release was only put further into question due to the strikes, but prior to that, star Haley Steinfeld revealed in June that she hadn't recorded any of her material for the next movie at that time. Considering it took five years to bring Spider-Man, across the Spider-Verse to life after 2018 Spider-Man, into the Spider-Verse, including COVID-induced delays, Sony may be hard at work on this third movie for quite some time, now, chances are high that this movie may not even be released before the end of 2024. But considering how highly its predecessor was praised, the wait should be worthwhile as Miles Morales completes this thrilling trilogy. Thank you for watch the full video, join us for epic tales, intimate dramas, and thought-provoking masterpieces that resonate with our souls. Don't forget to hit the notification bell, so you never miss an opportunity to dive into the captivating world of cinema.